This is all about how to calculate speed. Speed calculation is one of those things, like many things in life, that can seem very difficult, but are actually very, very simple. The one thing you have to remember, the only thing you've got to remember really, is speed is distance divided by time, or speed equals distance over time. The important thing to remember is that this divided sign and this over, this sort of slash here, they mean exactly the same thing. So don't be, don't be intimidated by them. All you're doing is dividing whatever the distance number you've been given is by whatever the time number is that you've been provided with. So here's a worked example. I've typed it out so you don't have to pretend to be able to read my handwriting. A grey-haired science teacher waddles 100 metres in 20 seconds. What is his speed? So my formula is speed equals distance over time. So it's distance divided by time. Our distance was 100 metres. Our time was 20 seconds, so 100 divided by 20 equals 5. And the units carry through to be 5 meters per second. If you're, if you're working in kilometers and hours, then it would be kilometers per hour. Or if you're working in miles per year or whatever it is, you take whatever your units for distance have been, and whatever your units for time have been, and that's what your final units are. It'll be your units of distance over your units of time.